right now, parents are fighting to keep their kids' schools open down at AISD headquarters. Nine Austin schools are on the chopping block now that the district is facing a $113 million budget shortfall. And right now, those parents against the plan are rallying outside the school board meeting. That begins at 7 o'clock. Tonight, the board voting on firing staff and teachers, which would result in larger class sizes in elementary schools in Austin. KXAN's Katina McHenry has more on what that means for your child. Katina? Robert, good evening. You mentioned the rally. About two dozen parents, maybe a little bit more, have already gathered outside in front of the boardroom here at AISD. They are here along with their children. Some are here from Pease Elementary, some from Jocelyn Elementary. They all are here for the same reason. Now, adding two more students doesn't seem like a lot. It seems like a small number, but for those that teach, 24 to 22 makes a dramatic difference. For teachers, it would mean more work. For students, it could change the quality of their education. What does the sentence say? Imagine trying to corral 22 5-year-olds or even 22 10-year-olds. Just trying to get them to sit down and pay attention can be a daunting task, let alone trying to teach them. Now AISD is recommending adding two more students to the classroom mix. If we have more kids in the classroom, it will be very difficult in their education. Increasing the numbers in the classroom will simply eat away at the teacher's ability to manage well to see that their, their classroom is, is orderly and focused on the lesson. By law, there can only be 22 students to every teacher. Some classrooms in AISD already have more than that due to a state waiver, but that increased class size could become the norm if approved by state lawmakers. To make up for the anticipated state funding cuts, AISD will decide whether to cut 537 teaching positions. That means the remaining teachers will have to take up the extra slack. I mean, the district is always uh, emphasizing the importance of differentiated learning, where some are high, some, some are low. And if we have so many, it's going to be very difficult to be able to teach them um, so they can be successful. Since we see numbers, and we're in a numbers crunch, so we want to find numbers, but we can't lose sight of our children. We can't lose sight of the impact in our classroom. The impact that could affect the students and ultimately classroom learning. Where we really need to be putting our, our, our thoughts and our laws and our money is in the elementary level where we're forming those ideas. Kids are establishing their opinions about education, about their future. And 1 to 22 was a great effort in addressing that need. Well, tonight at 7, the board members will take their seats behind me, planning to make some very difficult decisions here tonight. We will let you know exactly what happens. We are live in downtown Austin. Katina McHenry, KXAN, Austin News. We'll have continuing coverage on this issue on KXAN News at 6 as the board meeting draws closer, including some of the other things AISD plans to cut to make up for the big budget shortfall.